everyone, this is Colin Egan from Ironworks coming to you again from San Francisco um, where we just wrapped up day four of Usability Week 2010. Uh, so today we went over usage for mobile devices and we started with some statistics of overall usage on how mobile is currently used. Um, for example, you are twice as likely to pay for an application if you have one of these versus if you have one of these. We also went over usability best practices for designing on devices as well and some of the overall guidelines that you should be considering if you're developing an app for the small screen. Today's topic is touchscreen application usability. And that means iPhone, iPad, and Android devices. Overall, iPhone users have more downloads and spend more money than their Android counterparts, although that gap is shrinking. What are the best performing apps? Those that minimize interaction costs by being consistent with iPhone conventions. Design should be interruptible and should focus on how users interact on the go. Users are always on the go and when, when it comes to mobile they tend to do a lot of um, small tasks basically, not complex information gathering. If you take that into account you end up with an interface that's essentially very simple and allows people to go fast to, uh, to the uh, different options that you provide them. And how about the iPad? Well, it's closer to a laptop in terms of functionality. Design should focus on high quality graphics and including features like search. Tablets, um, well, they're very interesting uh, lately because, uh, because people are experimenting a lot with them. And so they've tried uh, kind of uh, going away from the traditional web model. Although you can design all these applications that uh, have these cool new interfaces, uh, the, the ultimate purpose it should be you know, making it easy for the users. Overall advice, keep it simple. The most successful apps are the ones that focus on allowing users to complete specific tasks with ease. Find a core functionality and design around it for best results. So that's an overview of usability for mobile devices. Now let's show you what you really wanted to see, and that is a stock photography birthday tribute to Jacob Nielsen.